everybody, welcome back to the channel and another episode of Inheritance. So today we're going to jump just straight into a battle. Our guys are back. Uh, mechs are all repaired. We're going to go in, I think I'm going to do this one today. I was thinking about doing this one here. Uh, but it is against Rassel Hag, so I want to add a bit more rep with them first before we go into that. So we're going to take an ambush convoy at one skull. I'm just interested to see what kind of opposition we're up against. I thought about doing this one here. Um, and just seeing how it played out, but most likely they'll get an additional lance. So I, I, I don't know. So I'm going to try this one. Uh, most likely with a one skull, they're not going to get an additional lance. It'll be the uh, the convoy and the guards, and there might be a couple of extra mechs, maybe if they get any additionals, but I doubt it. So we're going to take this one, just play it and see how we do. Going to go full salvage on it. Uh, we're going to accept. I've had I've been thinking about that. Um, actually, let's just deploy first. Now I'll, now I'll talk about it. All right, let's just go. Command interface initiated. Alright, here we go. Ambushing the convoy. Oh, standard map. So we can take them head on, which I think we probably will until we see what we're up against. I mean, we could come at them from this side too. Like normally I take them on from this side. Gives us the height advantage to be able to, like the ability to fall back from the guys shooting at us and just target the guards. Or target the uh, convoy, but I think we're, this time we're going to try something different. Let's go in from this side. So let's drop into the forest right here. Confirm that. So I'm thinking about that Arbiter and what we're going to do with that thing. I mean, it's only got one ballistic hard point and a lot of support. So I don't really know what can be done with what we have. Not a lot. We've got a Cloud Buster here. Nice. All right. There we go. Free them up. Let's move into here. Maybe get some sensors on. Good to go. Stay behind the rock. All right, nothing. Looks like we got three smokestacks here, so three internal combustion engines. Convoy, convoy guards. What can I do for you? Now it's supposedly a munitions convoy, so I don't think it's got a lot, but we'll see here. Let's move up. Got it. Max speed. Probably not going to see anything here either. Nope. That's fine. Okay, yep. granite. Need to get you down closer to the road so we can get some speed to get over there. Confirmed. Going through the trees is making me nice and slow. We'll do the same thing with the hunchback here in a second. So they've got a couple of slow vehicles there. It's interesting. I don't know what those would be. Let's go. Okay. So the Arbiter is pretty darn slow. I thought about putting the Ultra 2 on it and the hey. AMS, but the AMS kind of needs to be in close um, right. to our current max. And the ones that it would be the most effective defending would be these three up here. The Zoria the uh, Griffin and the Cephalus. Now it's never going to really protect the Cephalus because the Cephalus is just too fast. But as long as it can stay forward enough. Roger. All right, here we go. Got a chance to set up on these guys now. So what are we looking at? Skulker, Cloudbuster, Light LRM Carrier, Scorpion, Stinger, Scorpion LRM, and a Hunter. Now we've got two Hunter parts, so it'd be nice to be able to pick up another vehicle. Uh, how far can you get? Not that. Let's just walk it over to here for now. Park it. I want to pick off the faster moving vehicles first. Um, let's get this buzzard around over to here. Moving out. Hunchback up into here. And the Zoria. Let's get it around this side too. So yeah, it'd be nice to have another vehicle back again. Alright, how do we start this? Actually, you're going to reserve, I think. Waiting for my opening. 15%, eh?
19. Let's go in the Cloud Buster. I'm not going to move. Okay, someone's got a laser MS. I wonder if it's that... Uh yeah, see, you know, it's funny when you get those rolls. This is a one skull. And it, we got a good roll on this one, right? That is a stinger. Orders. I know, I was saying a couple of episodes ago, I'm looking for a stinger. It's terrible when you're looking just looking for a stinger part, but... Okay, we're going to expose a bit, but we're going to shoot at that cloud buster. I think it's really, at this point, the only threat that we have to worry about. Uh, we'll take shots at this guy. Somebody's got a laser AMS. I wonder if it's this guy. Could be this guy too, though. So that's probably got three LRM-10s. That would be a nice vehicle too. Um, there we go. Turn the frontal armor on. We're gonna. I, I know I said I was gonna move over with the, with the uh, cephalus, but I want to engage here. I think. Get a direct line of sight. That's not bad. I hope you could. Yeah, we're in a. We're kind of in an. That's a uh, landmines. We're kind of in an overrated um, missile build, unfortunately. So it's not really, um, we're not really optimal here. God, really. This should give us a lot of evasion though. Plus a bit of stealthiness. We, sh we should be fine here, I think. Uh, Cloudbuster Ballistic, so it's probably a pair of AC-5s. Alright, we got one on. Fair enough. Could be AC-2s, but I'm pretty sure it's a pair of AC-5s for the Cloudbuster. Yeah, it's a heavy sounding gun, so probably the AC-5. God, this sounds horrible. Are you serious? I'm wounded. <sighs> Jesus Christ. Let's give him some payback. Let's hope it hits. I don't know. Don't even know what to say. Why is it doing this? Same thing happened last time the first time the hunchback fired too. Let's hope it's a kill. I doubt it. Primary target damage. Yeah. Concentrate your fire and bring it down. I wonder if it's the APFSDS causing that issue. It could be. We didn't pen. That was a medium rifle hit, I think. So I, I don't know. Waiting on you, Commander. I don't know. Uh, yeah, it's just open up on this guy. I'm gonna drop the sensors down in here too. Roger that. Firing on target. Once again, we don't get the uh, we don't get a hit from the uh, large laser. I really gotta do something about that. It's generating a lot of heat and doing a lot like very little damage. So we gotta do something about it. Man, they really like the Zoria. I don't know why. LBX five, maybe. I I, I don't. Oh, no. I don't even know what to. How to even calculate that? Let's get over here. Moving to position. Not much we can do about the flames because we're standing in them. So, I'm gonna fire on this guy. Not enough, eh? Eh. Eh. 
Oh no, it's a stinger. Waiting for orders. Let's get up here. I don't have to play this one aggressively tough. Just keep shooting them. Switching to SRMs. At least one of the ultras hit. I'm here. Payback. Time for some payback. Gonna switch this out to see if it makes a difference. Well, we got the narc on him at least. God, the sound. Yeah, they're really loving this Zoria. Order. What do you think, kiddo? They're Lerm Scorpions, so let's get on them. Liking those chances. Good damage. Yeah, that Zoria's gotta get out of here. I'm gonna use it to chase down the other guy that's trying to get away and then we'll uh at least it's indirect but we really need to get an AMS like if we're gonna have this if we're gonna have vehicles that we're just gonna have at the back that are just shooting we're gonna need a we're gonna need a uh oof yeah AC5s we're gonna need a mech that's got an AMS that can protect them aye, aye. uh who do we want to deal damage to here where's the cloud buster Right there. I mean, I gotta reveal a little more to be able to do that. We could do this and block the road. Most of the oh crap, we don't have uh, our ultra up anymore. Then let's just do this Location confirmed. to get our ultra back and see if we can finish this guy off. That's pretty good chances to hit. Nice. You are not getting away. Commander. You might as well just like Moving to position. If they're going to ignore you, much to their chagrin, that's fine. Got the angle. Head to the shot. Should do it. Yep. Excellent. I hear you. All right, Griff. Um, hmm. Let's get around here. I want to put the sensors on these guys, but I also want to take a pot shot at this uh, carrier. Oh, that's beautiful. Gonna throw the rockets on too. Just hopefully we can get the kill out this guy. Fine. I don't know if we. I don't think we will, but okay. The laser hit and the sensors. Nice. All out of SRMs, Commander. You and your friggin' mines man you're gonna be driving right into those you guys <laughs> I don't know why you're like I got lots of mines spread them around I think we're gonna bum rush that guy get the cephalus on the stinger and bum rush him I think alright let's come back around this way Let's present a bit of armor. Let's 
Let's some let's drop some blood on those mother peepers. Oh, we hit the wrong guy, but we did hit though. God damn it, man. They're shooting at me. I know, we're gonna lose another vehicle too. Gonna do this. Oh boy, here we go. Generate some evasion, get some distance, present some different armor. Take a shot at this guy. Okay. Okay, looks like we panned probably his arm. Oh, leg. Even better. So he's got an AMS. Okay, a lot less. Using Inferno though. So that hunter, I mean if we get enough parts that hunter would be a good get if it's got Inferno ammo. Yep. Oh, they don't like me at all. Yes, Commander. Not the best on that guy, eh? Uh... See, those guys are just gonna try and get out of here, right? That's what they're just pushing forward, so they're, they're completely ignoring me. Let's go after the LRM carrier. Firing. That should do it. Yep. Hit him hard. Oof. Did they work on the explosions? Because they look a lot better. Or they just seem better. Yeah. Yeah. Hey. What's up, you? That's a fair bit of chunky armor. But let's uh, open up on them. I'm going to save these. Fire with these. Looks like they both hit. Ultra shots both hit, I think. Waiting on you, Commander. Mm, we can't have Griff get too close. Let's back up. If we get too close, then our regular LRMs are going to do a lousy job. I'm going to turn these off. Uh -huh. Laser missed again. So the Quick Cell Scorpion's got a uh, an AMS that it's using. So maybe the Scorpion might be a better bet. If we can get a if we get a Scorpion with a uh, laser AMS, it can just sit by the Zoria and then. Uh, protect it the whole time. Okay, you can cut it out now. I know, right? These punks, man, I'm telling you. Not liking this. Right here. Not liking this at all. Let's get like this. Let's take a shot at this guy. Targeting. 
Oh, Christ's sake. Really? <sighs> Did not see that one coming. Waiting for orders. Did not, not see that one coming. These are supposed to be freaking easy jobs, man. We need targeting computers is what we need. I need you to do more work. On the move. Should have probably gone against this guy earlier. Let's see what we can do in the back side. This guy's got a fair bit of armor, but might get lucky here. No. And of course, right when we're shooting him in the back, we get it all pretty much in the side. Like, I'm not even running around or jumping or doing anything crazy. And I still can't uh, catch a break here. So that guy's technically the convoy guard. So where are you damaged? On the far side. So if I come... around here... Not worried about that hunter. He doesn't have to... or this guy. He doesn't really have the juice to do a lot of damage to my back. So I'm coming after this guy. Dial that back to one. Reduce the recoil. Hopefully we don't jam here. We missed. What can I do for you? Right, Commander. I want you on that cloud buster, please. And please hit with the laser. Please hit with the laser. Right, Commander. Nope. just won't hit with that damn laser. I don't understand. I don't understand. So is this hunter not part of the convoy? Oof. Nice shooting. Backing it up a bit. That's not bad. But a hit on this guy in the side is a kill, so let's try and get this guy. Well, we hit him, but not in the right spot. Shoot him at the side, hit him in the front. Again. Same thing. Let's get down here on this guy. Can we... We'll overheat. I don't want to do that. Let's go this route. Roger, Commander. Angle is good. Okay, stripping armor, but it's all we're doing. And that time we hit him in the back. Could do that last time. Where's their evac? It's way the frick over here, so why are they going that way? Is he trying to get away, or what's he doing? Let's go over here. I think that hunter is trying to turn his back armor, or, yeah, trying to get his back armor to us so we don't kill him. Gonna save my SRMs. Let's turn this off for recoil. Let's go with the rocket packs. Secure the kill on that guy. One less target. SRMs are out. That's all right, baby. That's all right. 
Okay, Cloudbuster can't shoot you if we back up. That's a good thing. Target this guy. Let's not miss. Nice. Where do we hit? Okay. Yeah. Let's go this route. Did they change the percentage chance to hit with melee? I feel like they changed the percentage chance to hit with melee. Could be wrong. I hear ya. All right, Griff, this guy's all yours. Time to die. Or not. Oh, you got him. I <laughs> should just shut up. I thought he shot the front with the laser instead of the side. He probably did, but the but the uh, missiles were enough to take the side out. This guy's boss is going to be asking him where he where he was when the last vehicle was destroyed, and he's going to be I, I don't know, in the trees hiding. Holding. Ordered. All right. Um. E, let's do that so we don't step in the mines. Let's try and secure the kill on this guy. I think this guy's just confused as to where he's going or something. I don't know. Firing an enemy that should do it. Tango down. Yes, Commander. Okay, should just be that stinger, right? We'll take the thunder damage. I'm okay with it. It's only a handful. Get the shot off on this guy here. Come on, get that leg. Do anything. Shoot something. Gonna come around this way. All right, Bubba, where are you going? Wow, this could have gone really bad. I mean, we took way more damage than I thought we would when I saw the units up there, but... The fact that the Zoria went down, too, that's, like, just... Brutal. Good to go. They really wanted that thing dead. Maybe it's because it's got, like, it's clan tech and it's, it's worth so much? I don't know. Uh. What? What did it just shoot? I'm going to have to look at that again. In playback, I, what, I thought I was shooting the stinger. What the hell was I shooting? Moving to position. I, I what? The fuck was that? Well, at least the laser hit. Yeah, critical hit. Good to go. I don't even know what the hell that guy was shooting. Uh, we gotta rotate. There we go. That was so bizarre. Okay, there goes his arm. AMS is gone. Medium laser is gone. Good to go. Just give it up, buddy. That's pretty good chances to hit. All weapons fire. Did we hit our guy? We did. Mission successful. Yeah, I'm gonna have to have a look at that in editing because I don't know what it was that the cephalus shot. Like it looked, because it's it said left side destroyed, 
there was an explosion. So it looked like it hit a vehicle that was already there. Like, like I think that was the Zoria carcass that it was shooting at. So I have no idea what the stink was going on. Okay, Puka survived. That's good. good now the question is, did the Zoria survive? There's all the pieces of a Cloudbuster. And all the pieces of a scorpion. I think the cloud buster is really the no-brainer. Gonna do that for now just to see what else is down here. Two AC5s, endo steel, 120 core, flak. That would be nice, but not necessary. Wow, not a lot here, eh? Not a lot here at all. We're going to go this route, and let's hope, uh... Yeah, I don't know. This is weird. Where are the hunter parts? Like, I just up, I just updated, um... I just updated Rotec, and I'm wondering if there's issues. Because this looks like it's all the support land stuff up to 18 additional pieces so we should get most of this hopefully we get a scorpion as well let's see no we got one scorpion part lots of stinger parts though so if we want if we want to put a stinger together we can put a 5m together lrms regular armor we don't need it the 120 core i'm going to hang on to flat good fire control system standard we're going to hold on to that for now jump jets i'm going to hang on to so we have a few of them Basic sensors, we've got some. We don't need this. I don't think we need this. No, we can get rid of the structures. We made a bit of sea bills. Probably enough to put the Arbiter together and the Cloud Buster. I don't know, man. I don't know what happened. Okay, well, we still have the Zoria, which is good. I guess I should probably double check that because we're getting some weird stuff going on there. Now, I know it didn't show up, but yeah, it's still there. So, that's a good thing. Alright, let's go to storage. We need to get a vehicle pilot now. Um, there's the cloud buster. Let's ready this thing. That Nick you asked for. Yeah, baby. For it's the AC5 version. I like the pair of large I like the large laser version a little better, but... Um, we got flak ammo and AC5 ammo. Now, how much ammo do we have? 20 shots, so, okay, I don't mind this so much. In the, I think in the previous versions, the one I was looking at before, oh, you know what it was, you know what I'm thinking of? There was one with, um, it's the AC2 carrier. That's what I was thinking of. It's got four AC2s, but just not enough ammo to stick it out in a longer fight. But this has got plenty. 20 shots per barrel per ammunition type, plus the flak. Evasion pips ignored. Minus one recoil. 20% chance to deal a critical hit. Now, I think the recoil on the AC5s is one, isn't it? What's the recoil on this? It doesn't say here. But I'm sure an AC5 is one recoil, right? Um, can't refit it, but let's go to the mech bay real quick. I don't think we have an AC5, but I'm... We might. Uh, I just want to double check here. I'm pretty sure it's a recoil of one, in which case we don't have one. This is recoil one. So the recoil compensation for the flak should compensate for one of the two. Yeah. I'm not going to get this guy outfitted yet because we just don't need it. Although I wonder if I should just... Two hundred and ten thousand. Now I want to hold off. I think I want to hold off. Um, but what we do, we'll do is manage our tasks a little better. Hunchback's going to be gone for a bit. Let's bring the Talos up because I want to get the um, fire control system flak into that. Uh, let's refit real quick because we lost a bunch of stuff off the head of this guy when we punched out. Yeah, we're just still missing a bunch of stuff. We need, we just need stuff. 
Don't have enough gear. Let's get this on there for now. I put the rangefinders across um, as many mechs as I could. I put one on the Cephalus. I put one on uh, the Talos, and I put one on the Hunchback. I don't think I put. I don't. I'm pretty sure that's how I did it. I don't think I did it right. with the Griffin. I'll get it in the schedule. Eh, we can't tell here. Yeah, we put the rangefinder on the Cephalus, and we put it on the Hunchback, as well as the recon sensors on the Hunchback, just to help out with some sensor work. All right, well, I'm going to end this episode here. I was going to record a bunch of episodes back to back, but I'm actually kind of weary about it now because of what happened to that last mission. That random hit on some vehicle that didn't exist, and then half of the salvage not even showing up in the uh, like we didn't get any salvage from the from the convoy. So I'm not really sure what's going on. Maybe I'll try one more mission to see if there's anything janky, and then uh, and I'll record it. And then if we're still getting some janky stuff, then uh, I'll hold off. But by the time you see this episode, that may be patched out already. Uh, this is being recorded on the 27th, so um, the jankiness might be patched out. I don't know. But I'm going to look at the forums and see if there's anything, people, if, if anybody's mentioning anything about this, because the last update I wasn't having any problems, but this one I am. So, yeah. Anyway, I'm going to end the episode here, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. And please drop any comments in the comment section down below. Till next time, we'll see you later.